Hey everyone, Daniel from Twin Bytes with another tutorial for you, and this time I'm going to show you how to handle if your Windows 11 is zoomed in too much. There's a couple of ways of handling this, and I'm going to show you all of them and explain what they do, so that way maybe you want to make some kind of adjustment in between. So first of all, you can right click anywhere on your desktop and you can go into display settings. If you got more than one screen, you want to make sure that you choose the one that you're dealing with or you'll have to do this on both screens, possibly independently, depending on the options that we're changing. If you scroll down a bit, you're gonna see a few options here for scale and layout. The scale is gonna be your zoom level if you wanna go from 100% to some other percentage that is compatible with your display. So, you'll only have a certain uh, amount of options depending on your screen and your graphics card capabilities. Also, you've got your display resolution. So if you click in the drop down menu there, you're gonna have the recommended one, which is the highest resolution number. And the higher the number, the smaller everything is. But not only is it smaller, it's also more fine tune, crisp, it's going to look really nice. So what a lot of new computers are doing now that have such high resolutions is they're going to have it cranked up all the way to the highest resolution, which is so much higher than this that you can't even read it. Then you have to go into the scale and zoom it into like two or three hundred percent or something crazy just because it's that small. There's also manual options inside scale so if you click anywhere here other than the drop down menu then you'll see that there's a custom scaling and you can enter in manually anywhere between 100 to 500 percent so you notice if we go back and scroll back down here from 100% we only have the ability to go up to 175% but if we go in here we can choose up to 500 but it does say here that it's not recommended and it warns you right up here at the top that it might become unreadable if you scale it outside of what it's capable of handling so it's better not to do it here but if you need to you can go in here and play with that you also have text size so if you click down into the text size you're able to zoom in this way and for me I can go up to 225 percent it may again be different on each individual computer so let me know down in the comments uh, how far can you zoom in so this will only change the text on your computer not everything so if we have a look I'm gonna just move this a little bit uh, this way so we can see our Excel program and we've got some text in here and we've got this text up here so what you'll notice is that when I hit apply everything's gonna go big but we're not gonna have the uh, text inside the program going big so you can see now it took a moment to do it so don't freak out if it does take a while but even in this screen alone you can see that all this text is big all the menu options are huge and if we look at my excel program the everything here is absolutely enormous and uh, that's because i cranked it up all the way but just so that you can see the difference that the text here is still small so if you want to make it bigger there is zoom levels down here at the bottom so you could zoom in on the program in the individual worksheets that you're working on or just change it in one of the other areas that we looked at earlier with the display resolution let's just put this back for now and look at the next thing so aside from the zoom levels and text size there is another program if we search for zoom you'll see magnifier and in the magnifier that's a little bit different you would actually see it on your screen it tells you here there's a shortcut you can hit the windows key plus the plus sign to turn it on or the windows key and the escape key on your keyboard and that will turn it off or just go in here and uh, turn it on or off you'll see when you turn it on it shows up here and you can control the settings here you can also control them down here 
and you can see how it zooms everything right in and you have to shuffle around and for me I've got more than one monitor so it is uh, wanting to move the second monitor over as well so it's it's quite huge and hit the X to close out of it or just like I said hit the Windows key and escape and that will get rid of it and that's pretty much the options for controlling the zoom levels and resolution on your computer if I'm missing anything just let me know down in the comments otherwise that's it for this tutorial and if you found it helpful please do give it a thumbs up consider subscribing even better give it a super thanks and thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one bye for now